Alright, practice problem 6.6 .6 says, for n equals 4, what are the possible values of L? Alright, so here we're told that our, our n value is equal to 4. And if we're looking for the else value, okay, we know that means it must be from 0 to n minus 1. Okay, and so that means that this L value is going to be equal to 0, 1, 2, and 3. Okay, because n minus 1 is 3. So the second part of this says, well, if you have an L value equal to 2, what are the possible values of M sub L? Okay, so here we have L equals 2. Okay, well, if we're looking M of L, okay, it just means that it's from minus L to L, right? So we have minus 2, minus 1, 0, 1, and 2. And the third question says, if you have an M of L equal to 2, what are the possible values of L? Okay, so if we have M L equal to 2, the possible values of L means that L okay, must be greater than or equal to 2, okay, or that L is equal to 2, 3, or 4, because that would include the ML value of 2.